Nigel Cecil, calling things out as you like it, especially for his fair-minded friends. Hello, Chakabatis. Thank you for joining me, moi, Nigel Cecil, entertainment entrepreneur, responding to all comments and observations and requests and all kinds of things sent into my email address or my Twitter account. And Hillary, you can only sort them out for moi, don't you? Yes, and you're reminding me again when I say an entertainment entrepreneur, my fair-minded, equitable friends. And of course, Hillary say, well, in your own lunchtime, Nigel, in your own lunchtime, but this is Info Entertainment related to show business topics and things, well, all sorts of things across the United Kingdom, especially when we sometimes mention equity, the trade union for actors, variety, entertainers and other professional performers' creative talent across the United Kingdom. And now this particular video, flip-flop. Why? Be well, <laughs> yes, you were looking at that Conservative Party conference, weren't you? <laughs> and they got in touch with moi, my fair-minded friend, said Nigel. Are you going to award equity some flip-flops? Some flip-flops? I mean, as though equity, you think equity flip-flops? Well, I've got some news for you because, well, here's how it arises from something that Greg Hans said at the Conservative Party conference. I've always thought that the best leaders wake up each morning and ask themselves, what am I going to do today? Some leaders ask themselves, what am I going to say today? Sakira wakes up and asks himself, what am I going to believe today? And ladies and gentlemen, can I just let you into also a little bit of a secret? These are available. Anybody who likes uh, this association of Sakir Starmer with flip box, I have these available at the Conservative shop outside for just £16.99, also online at conservatives.com, your own pair of Sakia Starmer flip-flops. I warmly recommend them to you. What's that I hear someone says? How dare anyone involved in equity spend their time watching the Conservative Party conference? Uh, and also, that was Greg Hans apparently referring to Sakir Starmer. <laughs> Info entertainment from moi. So when my fair-minded friends say, what about this flip-flop business and equity? Uh, well, you know, get up in the morning deciding what to do. There's no way that's equity. Surely not, because the current radical, progressive, socialist activists controlling equity, they already know what they're going to do. They've got a long-term focused agenda. In fact, uh, we may be able to explain sometimes that it, it goes back to the 1990s. So when you say, give equity flip-flops, would I wave them in the air like a, a sort of manic in some ways? £16.60, whatever it is. <laughs> Me, do something like that for equity. Well, never in a million years would I. <laughs> but guess what? Yes, <laughs> give equity flip-flops. Well, we've got special ones. Just have a look. Chuck about it. <laughs> what do you think? Are no flip flop flip flops <laughs> awarded to equity? Indeed, it could apply to any organisation that's controlled by a radical progressive focus group who seem to think that they know exactly what they're going to do on behalf of all their members. And it's in a position where some 90 odd percent of the members are not really informed about what the objectives are. Is that democratically fair? Now, you see, there are those. I understand why you brought it to my attention. Who will be saying, well, you see, we have to campaign. Any organisation like that, you have to get a campaign together where those 90% of members unite and say, hey, we want control of our organisation. We want it to be responsive to all the members equally and fairly. So we'll run a campaign. Just look what happened at the Conservative Party conference. Thousands saying, bring down the Tory government. That's what we want. Is it? 
have a look at actually what was going on. Look at all the placards, the posters, the banners and the balloons and ask yourself, what does it mean? Placards, posters, banners and balloons included Tories out, campaign for nuclear disarmament, end austerity now, defy Tory rule, refugees welcome here, trans rights, defend right to strike, unite the strikes, protest and resist, cut wall, not welfare, no to racism, no to Islamophobia, organise strike, resist for Corbyn's policies, no to war, Black Lives Matter, hands off Assange, teachers before Tories, Sunak is a climate criminal, make Orwell fiction again, momentum, socialist worker, stop the the war, National Education Union, Unison Unite, Public and Commercial Services Union. Check about is Nigel Moir asking, what do you think that means? Clearly, protesters, thousands of them, all united under a common purpose. But when you look at the posters, placards, banners and balloons, all wanting to achieve, <laughs> to promote different causes... And that clearly undermines the validity of that common purpose. And that's why when it comes to campaigning within any organisation, even including equity, one has to remember that those who are focused, those who are radicals, never flip-flop. They don't flip-flop, do they, Hillary? What? <laughs> joke rooney time. What have you got for us, Hillary? <laughs> As usual, ending on a little joker rooney. Oh, what have you got for why, Hillary? <laughs> it's here, is it? Yes. Let's see what. Are, are, are we going with flip flopping? Are we? Oh, no. Hillary has chosen something about protest marches. Well, there we are. Here we go. Do you know the name of the U2 tribute band singer who gives their services for free? Uh, protest marches. <laughs> Would you like that again? It's a bit of a mouthful. Do you know the name of the U2 tribute band singer who gives their services for free at protest marches? <laughs> I like this one. <laughs> it's pro bono, pro bono. <laughs> or is it pro bono, pro bono? <laughs> Make your own mind up. But until the next time, I'm going to try on my flip flops. Do join me again.